Say hi from Cherish Math. Here is the question. Two identical circles with radii of two are drawn in this diagram. Each of the centers is located on each circle. A square is inscribed in the overlap parts of the two circles. Find the area of the square. And this question is adapted from UKMT. In the first step, I'm going to connect a line from the center to the other center and from the left center to the corner of the other side. For the first line that I've drawn here, this is the line of bisector that splitting the square into 50-50. So for this part that I am pointing, let's say I'm going to name it as x, this represents half of the side length of the square. And for the lower part here, that would be the same. While for this part, this is the complete side length of the square that stands for x plus the other x, and I'm getting 2x here. For this line, this is the radius of the circle. And since two units is given, so this is exactly 2. And for this part, it is at the right angle. And now, for the length of this blue line, it is the same as the other end of the blue line. To find just one part of this blue line, I am going to use the entire length, which is two units, minus the red line here, which is 2x. And I have to divide by 2 simply because it is shared equally for the left and the right lines. And the answer that I'm getting here is 1 minus x. Next. I will have to find the distance from this center up to the point of this square here. This is going to be 1 minus x, that is the distance of this first blue line, plus this red line, that is exactly 2x. So the answer that I'm getting here is 1 plus x. I'm going to use the Pythagoras theorem by working on this triangle O, A, B. And now, this is the first equation by using Pythagoras theorem. I'm going to expand and rearranging it. In the next step, I have to find for what is the value of x by using the quadratic formula. And the value of this x has to be in the positive. And that is the reason why the negative here is dropped out. And I'm getting the value of x is the square root of 7 minus 1 divided by 2. In the final step, I'm trying to work out what is the area of the square by using the side length of 2x times 2x. And that is equal to 4x squared. I have to substitute the value of the x here into this. And now, simplifying it, I'm getting the value as 8 minus 2 times the square root of 7 as the final answer for the area of the square. I solved the puzzle here. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe.